Hi, I'm Gary from organicweb.com.au and I'm a MailChimp partner. Today I'm going to show how we can authenticate our MailChimp domain in Cloudflare. In other words, if you use Cloudflare as your DNS host, I'll show you the records we can add or how we add those records to Cloudflare to get better delivery rates for our email marketing from MailChimp. Let's go across to MailChimp itself. First of all, I'll just go through a few terms and then I'll show how simple it is to actually authenticate our domain. The first thing to say is that if we, in MailChimp, click Website to the top of the screen and then Domains. So I've clicked Website, then Domains. Underneath Verify Your Email Domain, you can add various domains here and then send emails from MailChimp as if you're on those domains. When you first click Verify Email Domain, you'll be able to add a domain to MailChimp that you can send from. MailChimp will send you an email. Once you click on the confirmation that you've received that email, it shows as verified here and you'll be able to send from MailChimp as if you're sending from that domain. We can do a little bit more, however, and get to green authenticated, and this is highly recommended. By authenticating our domain, we have a far better chance of getting through spam filters, for example. The delivery rates will be far better. What we need to do is add some records to our domain, domain name system. So we add some domain records. So I'll just go across to, to Cloudflare quickly. And I'm in just one of my example uh, domains. Now I'm going to click on the DNS to go to the DNS section. And for those of us that have seen this before, this, this looks very normal. But if it looks a bit scary, don't worry. It's really not that confusing. The DNS is those records so that, for example, um, in this case, if someone on the C name goes to www.plusmarketingapp.com, it means it'll just redirect them to plusmarketingapp.com. So this is almost like the traffic light system on the web. Someone asks for a name, for example, for, for a domain name, and they redirect it somewhere. And this is where we add various records and so on. So what we need to do is, because we're going to add the records to Cloudflare, we need to get the records we need to add from MailChimp. So I'll go across to MailChimp. So again, we're under Website, Domains, and wherever you have Blue Verified, what you want to do, and I'll just scroll a little bit, click Authenticate, and you'll notice that a pop-up comes, and MailChimp actually tells you what to do. So without reading at all, what it's saying here is that create a CNAME record for that with that value and create another CNAME record for that with that value. So let me show you. First of all, we're just going to copy this first bit. So I'm just going to copy that. So k2 dot underscore domain key. Come into, um, into Cloudflare, make sure you're in the right domain, click on DNS, and we're just going to click Add Record. So click Add Record. Now, MailChimp said to us, and I'll go back to MailChimp, MailChimp said add a CNAME record. So we're gonna click, uh, we clicked, sorry, Add Record. And here, I'm going to change the type to be CNAME. Then, just going back, where it says k2 dot, um, dot underscore domain key, under name, just paste that first bit in there, k2.domainkey. And the target, you don't actually need to put this extra bits, these extra bits in. The target is that. So I'm just going to copy that, come back, and put it into here. That's all I need to do. You don't need to do, uh, you, you don't need to do anything else here. That's all you need to do. And we'll click save. But remember, there's now a second record we need to add. So I'll do this a little bit more quickly. I'm just going to copy that first bit, copy it to my clipboard, come back in here, click Add Record. What we want is a type of C name. We're going to paste in that first bit, K3, etc. Come back to MailChimp, get that value, copy it, come back, place it in here, and paste it. Okay, and save. 
Now, if we look down the screen slightly, you'll notice that we've those two C name records have been added. The K2 redirects to that, and the K3 goes to that. So we've done what we need to. That's all we need to do, and that's all we don't ever need to come back and change this again. So going back into MailChimp, all you need to do now is click Authenticate Domain. Now, okay, MailChimp's given a warning that not enough time was given. This can take quite a bit of time, you know, 24 to, to 48 hours to go through the web, but MailChimp will keep checking for you and will check that it's done. But honestly, that's all you need to do. So again, and, and I'm just going to cancel this, you click Website, Domains, wherever you have Blue Verified, Click Authenticate, so I click Authenticate there for example, and MailChimp says to you what to do. Create a CNAME record for that, with the value of that, etc. I came into Cloudflare, went to DNS for my domain name, and I just added those two CNAME records. And now, well, when it's authenticated in 24, 48 hours time, you will absolutely notice better delivery rates for your emails. And that's how simple it is. I'm Gary from organicweb.com.au.